Good morning, everybody. Good morning. So we have just left Mon Monachil. Monachil. Um, yes, uh, we fought the gorge and the gorge won. <laughs> yeah, uh, we're not doing that again, ever, and do not recommend. Um, so we are heading now for Montreal. Here comes the sign. Thank you very much. Mo Montreal? Montreal. Montreal. Um, which is about an hour's drive away at Coast Beach. Um, and we just need to actually do some admin. So we're going to try and get onto a site for some electric hookup. Um, yep, yeah, and get the van cleaned, a bit tidy, and um, yeah, take a rest. I think we need to decompress a little bit after yesterday. Um, I think we're all a bit like, ooh. Um, yeah, and then we are heading further down the coast. So, <coughs> yeah, see you when we get there. Okay, so we have just arrived in Montreal. Uh, it took us about half an hour? No, 58 minutes. All right, 58 minutes. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> my, my concept of time there. <laughs> but we are at this cute little park up. Um, there. I'll do a park up review, but this cute little park up there, 17 euros a night, including five kilowatts of electric. We're not going to use that because we don't use that much. We're just going to charge max and uh, yeah. But just between, if you look, really really just between there there's a sea view yeah <laughs> <laughs> but yeah we're only we're a quick walk from the from the beach um but we've just got here dogs are having a little bit of a sniff around in this vacant plot next to it and then we will go and get some lunch but yeah here we are nice weather's not great <laughs> Blowing in the wind. <laughs> Kaisen does not care. Get me to the beach. <laughs> Literally the only time that Kaizen couldn't care less where mummy is because she's right over there <laughs> and he doesn't care because he's getting his beach time. Come on, we'll come back in a minute. On, Let's go. Good boy. My God, first time he's done that. Come to Spain, they said. <laughs> I'm actually, literally dripping. And dogs are soaked. <laughs> oh my goodness. What the hell? <laughs> um, yeah, we thought we'd go for a nice little evening stroll so. with the dogs. And we literally got four minutes down. It started raining a bit. And we we're like, oh, it's yeah. fine. And then this happened. About 10 minutes <laughs> into the walk. And there's thunder. Another storm's coming. Yeah. 
Yay, another storm. So it's like we're gonna be Yeah. Stay here a while. What do you want me to do, babe? <laughs> I know. We tried to take you out. We tried, darling. Oh my gosh. Um, yeah, so apparently Yeah. It it does Papa. Really It's raining. What are we gonna do? Right. Wow. Yeah. Right. Okay. Rethink time. Um, we are, yeah, very excited. The lady that we met at the last campsite said that it's stunning, it's beautiful, and we have to go. So we have just driven along, and um, yeah, we've got a little park up that we're going to go to in a bit. But first things first, shopping. We're completely out of food, so Dad's going to take the kids for a little wonder woo, and I'm going to go and get some food. <laughs> So after a little bit of messing around, we have finally found a park up. Uh, the first one we went to was closed. The second one they said to us, no full. Um, but we have found this fabulous, enormous place. So yeah, very happy. We've got food, we've got full uh, electrics, toilets empty. We got excited woofers. Um, so yeah, it's gonna be a good weekend. It's kind of mad. It's it, putting the things into perspective, it's like, we think it's big driving an A-Class and then there's this guy here with just this absolute monster of a rig and you think, my God, how do you get anything like that anywhere? And then you go and turn around and you go, are you kidding me? That thing there makes that look like our A-Class. It's just... Enormous. How on earth do they negotiate getting that anywhere? I'm real. <laughs> hey guys, it's a beautiful day and we've decided we're gonna go for a walk along the rocks and see what we can find. So join us.
we're in the Plaza Tutti Frutti. We, well, we're, go we're going to Pla Plaza, Plaza. Plaza Tutti Frutti. <laughs> oh, we gotta do that. <laughs> Let's go! Well, I'm guessing this is it. It's an evening. Uh, yeah, it must be a night, nightclub-y. Seven? Yeah. Tutti Frutti. He's barking. Ah. He's barking at us. Again. <laughs> We found a park! Should we see if there's any green spaces? Because at the moment, it looks mostly like it's, it's for children and concrete. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that would be nice, but you can't seem to get to it. So, no zoomies for you. Let's keep walking. Good ice cream. Yeah. Yeah. Kids love theirs. Sorry, we um we didn't film them eating them because it was chaos. <laughs> Good morning guys, so I've got the deuce having a morning coffee up on this lovely platform, the gorgeous view and uh, yeah we're at this um, this caves um, attraction so yeah gonna go in and have a look in a bit got here nice and early the car park is completely empty so we've got a pick of spots we've got one in the shade which is really nice uh, it's only two euros for apparently the whole day and uh, we got free tickets because we are European. Um, so yeah, it's gonna be a nice cheap day, hopefully. Um, yeah, and sun's out and it's gorgeous. So um, it's gonna get to about 15 by about midday and then it should get a bit hotter in the afternoon. So our tour is at 9.30 uh, and it should be over by 10. So kids will be uh, having a great time just chilling out. We have arrived. We have arrived. We're, dogs are having a little bit of a bally session because we've got a completely clear car park. Stop it. Yeah, we haven't had bally in ages, have we? Yeah. Ready? Is. You love it, don't you? <laughs> Oh,
most incredible places you've ever, ever been. Oh my God, it's just, what do you think? Just it's like being in a natural cathedral, yeah. it's so bizarre. And yeah. I don't know if the video is gonna show you really the full height and everything, but yeah. it's just phenomenal. Stunning. Okay, so uh, Caves of Nerja done. Um, yeah, wow. Beautiful. Just, you yeah. cannot comprehend how just ginormous they are. <laughs> you think you start going through and it's just like caves and it's, you can, you know, normal ceiling height, two, three meters, and then it just opens up into this massive cavern mm. that is just like a cathedral. And it's, yeah. So the 9.30 session is free. You have to book, you can't book uh, any more than 48 hours in advance. Um, but yeah, 48 hours in advance, 9.30 free. For if you European pay citizens. for European citizens, yeah. if you um, pay 20 euros, you also get a train, is it? A little train Train cart? ride. Train and ride. there's a virtual reality thing, which is apparently really good. Yeah, um, has been recommended. But you can buy the virtual reality separately, separately which I think is six yeah. euros. The train takes you deeper into the cavern than you go um, by foot, so yeah. yeah. But, um, but it was think, such an, a massive amount plenty. that we saw already. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Just. Yeah. And <laughs> got here nice and early, so got great parking space, and uh, it's two euros yeah. to park. So we're going to go and do a little bit of exploring. Yeah. And if you are coming in at my time, it's easily accessible. Yeah. Um, just watch the park up review I did. But um, yeah, there's just loads of people here in motorhomes. Um, perfectly good. All right, we're going to get the doofs and see if we can find a nice walk to do because we've got all day here. So catch you in a bit. Who's ready for adventure? We are. So we did the caves this morning, little costume change, and we are heading down to hopefully what is a wild beach. Um, so it feels pretty remote <laughs> to be fair, um, but we're following Google Maps in the hopes that we can get some swimming time because poor little boy hasn't been in the sea for like two whole days. And he's getting withdrawal symptoms and he's suffering. Um, so hopefully, fingers crossed, we can get down to some sand. is like oh so beautiful just love it <sighs> wild beach oh god she's got splashed did you see her <laughs> did you get splashed girl <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Dufos, you're coming in. Come on in. Come on in. <laughs> 
<laughs> May, she coming in? Not a chance, Dad. Did you nearly go then? Yes. It's quite sharp. Yeah. <laughs> I'll just keep filming in case you go. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> hey, Jobs. Some bamboo. <laughs> you like your little hovel, don't you? So we think you may have discovered that our lovely beach is actually a nudist beach. <laughs> it's, it's, only for uh, boys. Apparently only for boys though. Yes. We have three boys. <laughs> so we're on this beautiful wild beach and it is absolutely stunning. So Mazakin is just behind me and she's uh, she's just playing with some bamboo. Leon is sun tanning and Kaizen is just staring at us waiting for somebody to come and throw some rocks in the water for him not to go and chase he's uh, been a right pain <laughs> so we've decided to ignore him <sighs> so we've had such a wonderful time at the beach it's just been absolutely perfect and uh, unfortunately we have to go back because we think that the car park that we're in might close but we might think about moving and come back tomorrow because it's just been absolutely glorious and the dogs have had the best time ever so yeah let's see So, yeah, there's that. Here nice. <laughs> <laughs>